Hi, James with the OneHourSmartHome.com. And today we're gonna to explain to you what color is the neutral wire. So in a typical light switch, if you've got newer wiring, um, the white wire is always going to be the neutral wire. And you can see this right here. Uh, this is the white wire. Um, this is the neutral wire. And we'll explain the other color codes and what those mean as well in a typical light switch. So. If you've got a home built, I would say after 1965, uh, your wiring is going to be colored uh, with the standard color conventions. If you live in an area where no conduit is used, you're gonna have green for ground, white for neutral, and black for hot or the load line. If you live in an area with conduit, you're always gonna still have white for neutral, but your load and hot lines might be a different color because they use those different colors for different circuits. However, they all will have a color and it is never green and it is never white for a hot line. The neutral line is always white and the ground is always green or it would be bare copper wire. wire. So we'll zoom in here a little bit closer so you can see exactly the wiring. And this would also tell you how to find a neutral wire if you had a light switch and wanted to know if you could put a smart switch in. So we've got a smart switch wired up here and it is uh, live wiring. I'm just being very careful and I tape these up just for the video so that uh, I can do that without uh, getting shocked. But uh, we'll zoom in and show you the white color wire for the neutral and then the hot and the load lines and the ground wire as well. So give me a second here. Okay. And Here's what we've got. So, the white wire is neutral right here, okay? And you can see on the back, there's this handy dandy um, combination of what the wires are. So you've got red is load, G or ground is green, and black is the hot or line, and white is neutral. So uh, in order to see what else is going on in here, we can pull these wires out. And you can see in the case of my electrical circuitry, um, the hot wire, or actually this is the load wire. So the load is the wire that goes up to the actual light fixture. That's yellow. For a lot of you, if you live in an area without conduit, it's gonna be black, okay? but. In a case with, uh, if you've got conduit, it could be black, it could be red, it could be orange, it could be whatever it is. Uh, it depends on how they wired it. So my load wire is uh, yellow. We've got another video that explains home wiring, so you should watch that if you're interested in learning more. And now this is what you gotta be really careful with right here. This is the hot wire, okay? And it is wired in red. And you can see white on there, that's just paint. Whoever painted, uh, this area when they sprayed the paint they didn't have the covers on and they got paint in the junction box and that's what's on there But uh, you can see the hot wire is red and that hot wire uh, Then goes down to the light switch which is called line. So hot wire is red Here uh, that is the power coming into the actual light fixture the power going out of the light fixture uh, It goes through this load wire here, which is yellow and then you can see back here all the other wires in here for this light switch. And you can see the white wire, the neutral wire. And while you've got two neutral wires um, and then the neutral connecting this switch or any of these other ones that you've got two wires for is because you've probably got a neutral wire coming in from somewhere else in the house. And then you have the neutral wire going back up to the light fixture or the next fixture or next outlet in the line here. So same thing here with this red one. Um, this is the hot wire. You've got a hot wire coming in from uh, into this circuit, but you also have a hot wire going out because there is another light switch on this circuit. So that's what's going on here. And then you only have the one yellow wire because this is only controlling one light. So that's the reason that you've got this one yellow wire here. So we hope that that explained to you what color a neutral wire is. Uh, it is universally white. If you've got newer wiring after 1965, that's what they should have put in. Now, there are some of you that have very old houses. If you have a very old house, your wiring convention may not follow any of this. You may just have wires that are all the same color. 
and that makes it a little bit harder to determine what the neutral is. In order to determine if you have a neutral or what the neutral wire is when you have all the same color wiring, you have to use a multimeter. And then how you could figure out which one's neutral and which one is the hot is that you could temporarily ground that on the ground wire or another grounded device and you could determine if that wiring was hot or if it was neutral. If it's hot, it's gonna show 120 volts on the multimeter. If it's not hot, uh, it would show zero volts or something right around zero. So that is the color of a neutral wire. We hope you enjoyed this video. Please like and subscribe. And if you wanna learn more about home wiring, um, you can go ahead and do that by looking at the playlist below. Thank you.